What is up guys, Gully Kevin today back with another episode of Skyrim Mods and today we're going to be looking at the Sea Dogs Pirate outfit which is freaking amazing, it can be made into armour which is awesome but guys before we start the video if you want this particular mod and you like the looks of it I thought it looks really weird, make sure to go down in the links to the description they're all there so go and click those and go and grab them so we're here in my favourite place in Dragon's Reach at the Skyforge and once again he's always on the forge, I've no idea why he can't just stay in one place, he's here like all the time. Surely he hasn't got that many orders to fill. Okay, so here we go, we're gonna go straight into it. Now this is cool because it's got his own section. I think it's in studded, yeah, it's in studded. So we're gonna go into studded here, and as you can tell, we've got the sea dog's armor, which is awesome because on his right side he's got a small bottle of something. I'm gonna say whiskey with the skull and crossbones. Also got a little plate shield on the left leg there. Nice little uh, pockets running along the chest, but there. Just overall a nice sleek little looking bit of armor there. You got the boots here, which kind of remind me of just standard leather boots, which is odd. Not if they should be, but they just remind me of standard leather boots. You got a cape for same some strange reason, but I've actually seen this and I've actually done all the sort of thumbnails and things before I've actually showcased this one. So this cape actually does go really well with the sort of armor. I have no idea why, but it just does. You wouldn't think so. An eye patch, obviously we're gonna need one of these because what pirate is an incomplete without a patch. Sea Dog's hat. Now this is the feathered version. You can get the normal version. I've chosen the feathered version because you know it just looks I think main pirates are just always should just have feathers in the hats. I don't know why. Every time you see like a big a big important pirate, they always have feathers in the hat. It's kinda of weird. Sea dog gauntlets, again they're exactly the same as the leather ones to be honest in my eyes, but obviously they are standalone. So again there's probably a little bit of tweaks but I'm probably too blind to see them. Uh, you've got the standard hat here, which is just on without feathers, and then obviously you've got the vanilla standard armor within this particular standalone mod set. So I've made them all already. A nice little addition you can do as well. I think it's in glass. I think I'm pretty sure it is in glass. I'm not going to go there because it will show off some other future mods. Uh, it is in glass, so you can actually make the Sea Dogs sort of sword, which we've made as well. So don't worry about that if you want to have a look at it. So here we go. Let's chuck on the appearance here. Let's put the armor, the boots, the cape, the eye patch, and the hat, and the gauntlets on. And let's have a. Oh my lord, look at it. Look how cool it looks. The gauntlet there. Oh wow, I didn't see the flintlock pistols. And there's the flintlock pistols as well within the chest and there's two flintlock pistols as well or is that one? that's one flintlock pistol down near the belt two flintlock pistols within the chest the cape as well, I think the cape sets it off beautifully the hat is awesome, I don't see the point in having the normal hat or without the cape, let's just try what it looks like without the cape just because I'm concerned nah, it needs to have the cape for me to be honest gotta have the cape but it does look freaking beautiful. Let's obviously have a look at the gauntlet, uh, not the gauntlet, the sword as well, as you can see. Sea Dog's Cutlass, which obviously is pretty much a sort of a pirate era sword as well. It does look freaking sick. Look at that blade. I love blades like this in this game. There are so many games, great games that do have sort of blades like this. Uh, the hilt and the handle, not too bad, not too bad. I'd love a little bit more detail on that, but besides that, you know, it is pretty damn cool. So it's obviously equipped with that. And uh, let's have a little look in sort of free cam here. Okay, so let's just have a little look at all of it. Okay, so the boots, not too bad, just standard sort of leather boots throughout that. As we go, oh, it's a little bit quick. This, as we go up here, as you can tell the flint lock pistol there. There's no glitchy sort of animations or sort of textures just yet, which is freaking amazing. Obviously, that's that little bottle there with the sort of skull and crossbow flag, which is awesome. As I say, the cape you need to have the cape on this. I mean, look from behind, I just looks freaking sick. The sword as well goes makes us justice done with this outfit, it's freaking amazing. The plate as well, the armor, pretty damn cool. I like how my character looks as well because uh, if we go up here and we go back into it, and I'll show you in a minute as well, which is kind of cool. I didn't even realize until I did this, just I'll tell you off topic. Let's go to eye patch and let's go here again. And if I show you, he actually doesn't have an eye. See? which is pretty damn cool. So I think this kind of fits in very well. Again, let's have a look at the final piece on this, which is the hat. Just look at that. It's 
just the feathers, man. They, it, this is amazing. But again, I'm pretty sure there's some other mods out there to do with Skyrim for boats. So if you wanted a sort of a a mini video or even a playthrough for a whole pirate, then this I'd recommend this one entirely. Uh, I, I think I was going to say it's a one of a kind because I haven't actually seen or covered anything like this just yet to date. And uh, yeah, I've been sort of sifting through the website an awful lot, so I haven't found anything else just quite like this. So this. For me, it is beautiful and it is awesome. So guys, as I say before, if you want to get this, it's down in the description below. Go and grab it, go and share some likes and love with this guy as well. This is awesome. But guys, if you did enjoy the video, make sure you hit me up with a like and a comment. Also as well, guys, let me know if you're going to get this mod or any other of my mods or you're enjoying my mods or enjoying my videos. I'd really like to get some feedback from you guys. Obviously, I'll reply to every single comment. But until the next one, guys, kill a kevin and kill a kevin out.